Today I wanted to test if longer prompts give better outputs in Mid Journey V4 or are these long prompts just a waste of time? So I did create some prompts that had over 330 descriptions and compare them to a more minimalistic approach. Did I see any difference? Let's find out. Okay, so how we're gonna test this is I have created two different scripts. One script that creates just a normal length prompt and one that creates like a 300 plus length <laughs> prompt. Uh, but we're gonna use the same user input here. We're gonna use for a car color. We're gonna use matte black slate carbon. The car type is gonna be a Porsche, and the location is gonna be California. So let's just start off by doing like a normal prompt. So let's head over to the terminal, run our first script here. So what color is the car? It's matte black uh, slate carbon. Uh, what type of car is it? It's a Porsche. 911 turbo where's the car located uh california so let's run that and here we get the prompt uh a math black car slate carbon jillian jones edges yeah okay let's copy that head over to mid journey and paste the prompt uh and let's bring up the other script okay so now let's uh run our other script this is gonna be i've set this to around 40 50 prompts now so the color is going to be matte black uh, slate carbon and it's in California. So let's run that. Okay, so I think this is around 40 prompts. So let us copy that, add over to mid journey, paste, and let's see what we can get from this. Okay, so what we actually are testing now is just will adding more prompts make a better image? The descriptions we get are just random here. Uh, we can't really expect that, but let's just test it anyway. This image was the short prompt or like the normal prompt. Looks very good. It's it's not a realistic image. It's more of like a drawing. Here's the long prompt. Also quite cool. It's a bit of a different style. It's more colors and I can't really tell what kind of prompt that made it like this. But I guess, yeah. So let's try to add more prompts here now and see what happens. Okay, so I thought we aim now for around, uh, maybe around 100 prompts. California, and let's hit enter. Okay, so I don't know how many this is. Let's copy and check. So let's copy that. Head over here, paste, and do some word counts. So words, 117. Imagine paste that and let's see what we can get from this okay so this is what we got back from around 100 was it 117 prompts and wow it looks stunning but is it uh is it because of the long prompt it's very hard to tell my instinct says no but look at this it's very realistic and i like the like the blurry background so this was stunning so i think we got a try maybe we can use this prompt to remove like half of it later and see if we get the same okay now let's just go for the big one straight away let's try to aim for around it's gonna be between 300 and 350 prompts i think so matte black slate carbon it's a porsche 911 turbo california and yeah let's see what we can get here okay so here's the prompt Damn, that was long. Uh, okay, so let's copy all of this. Let's check how many words this is. Uh, so I I'm also going to try to check for uh, censored words. 368 prompts. So I'm just going to check for some banned words. And then we're going to put this in. Okay, so after removing some words, uh, we ended up with around 315 prompts. So let's take those over to mid journey and see what this can produce okay let's paste yeah that's a lot of prompts okay so here we got the image back <laughs> look at this long prompts Lo looks ridiculous right uh okay so let's have a look at the results it looks stunning but i can't say can i tell difference from this was around 100 and this is 315 it's basically the same so there's no difference uh in my opinion it looks great though it looks very realistic i think now we're just gonna remove the like the half of it and run it again and see if we get something different okay so i stripped this uh prompt now down to 
uh, it's 135 prompts. So let's copy that and try to run this and see if we can tell any difference. Okay, so here we can see uh, we only did half of the prompt. We just moved the back end. Uh, and wow, as expected, uh, there is there's no difference. To be honest, it, this one even looks better. So here was the one with 315 prompts. We just removed the... Uh, I guess the 150 last inputs and we basically got the same image it looks awesome there was no difference like in the last 150 prompts at least that's my conclusion so far but uh, at least that's my takeaway for now okay so the, at the end of this video i thought i would just uh, run this uh, the more simpler script a few more times uh, it's quite fun and you can get some awesome results from it so this is uh, car based and let's just run a few different kinds of cars and colors and see if we can make something cool let's do electric carbon blue what type of car is it off-road ev where's the car located sahara copy the prompt are you happy with the prompt uh no and then the script restarts and we can do another one. Okay, so we got this one back. This was a car, silver and gold carbon. Marie Baskirsef Edges. Tractor Norway Sporty Illustrative. And that, this is just awesome. I love they put in a mountain behind that. That's typical Norway. If I look outside here. And look at the tractor. It's so cool. Like I love the gold and carbon. And yeah. Awesome. Okay. So the next one is this uh, Formula One car. Uh, it's black and red neon. Uh, Damien Hurst edges. And cartoonish. So I, I guess this is very inspired by the. Maybe it's Damien Hurst. I don't know him. And cartoonish. Uh, but I really like it. This would be an awesome poster, like if you were like a probably a Ferrari fan or just a Formula One fan, uh, I guess. So I think this one was actually my favorite. So the prompt is like an electric carbon blue, Trenton Osborne edges, off road EV, Sahara sporty glowing. So yeah, I think this was my favorite, not just because of the car, but also like the aesthetic from the Sahara. And how the, the wheels go down into the sand. And, and you can see the shape of the sand here now in the foreground. So this was very impressive. So I think this was my favorite. Uh, let's have a look at the last one. So the final one was this uh, black matte carbon gray Ashley Longshore Edges futuristic Tesla EV. New York Regal and stylized. So this was very dark though. Uh, but there's some shades of gray and white in behind there. You can see like the Empire State Building. So we are in New York. Uh, but the weird thing here was all those rocks in front of the... Uh, the you can still see it's a Tesla, I think so. Yeah, right. Uh, with the, the rims and the hood and the logo. But the, these stones there were very strange. I don't know why, but I kind of like it anyway. Uh, a bit gray maybe, but yeah, quite cool. Okay, so I hope this gave you some answers if you were wondering about long prompts. Uh, anyways, check out some of my other videos here about generative AI. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again.